Hello everyone, welcome to another fan to play fantasy match preview. This is for the game between India and Netherlands. It's going to be an important game for both teams. Not like must win, but yes, they want to get through. Especially India and for Netherlands, they want to put up a big fight because it's a big stage, a lot of viewership. So they want some big players to shine there. And in this video, we're going to cover venue conditions, your jersey winners. We'll also have a jersey giveaway at the end. And obviously, your base team in the middle, along with some interesting prizes. And I have Nikhil Bhai with me today to carry you through this preview. Yes, uh, thank you so much, of course, for having me. But uh, but this is why every time we India, we don't have any game. So hopefully, India has a little less drama, a little less thrill game. Bhi chal uh, but it's not so much thrill that the World Cup will be in 2007, because this World Cup is happening in this World Cup, literally hmm. kuch bhi ho hai. So just to put that disclaimer up, anything can happen. Yes, absolutely. And before we get to venue conditions, we have the jersey winner for the game, the New Zealand-Sri Lanka game. Tushar Dhruv, Marcus Toynis, 91 points, just two points away from the actual point score. So congrats to Tushar, you're going to get your jersey very soon. All you need to do is DM on the Fantasy Crick Pro Twitter handle with your contact number, address details and your name. Okay, not your name. I have your name. And <laughs> we'll get it sorted for you very soon. So many congrats to you. And for the rest of you, we have another jersey giveaway at the end of this yep. video. So stay tuned for that. Great call, Marcus. Great call. Yes. And also, uh, there is no winner for the England versus Ireland game because uh, no one predicted Liam Livingston, obviously, even though I was expected to predict it. But yes, no one predicted it. So no winner there. And let's look at venue conditions. Yes, many shots fired. And let's look at venue conditions. SCG, like we mentioned, first game, we expect some rain. And we covered the venue conditions in detail in that video if you want to look at it. But overall, in the second game, we don't see any rain issues. But like the weather has been in Australia, you can just never say because that was the case for yesterday's day two. And uh, apart from that, like you know, your square boundaries are slightly shorter. So it will be interesting to see how spin plays out in these conditions. Yes, uh, I think we have discussed it earlier, just to reiterate it, uh, average score will remain the same, 150 to 165, 170. Uh, if there is rain, hota hai, the rain carries through from the first game, which is not going to happen, then it could make the contest different. Please look out for any hints that you can about the pitch. Uh, say, if you saw the England game today, for sure in the second game, you would have had more paces because of the way the paces were getting held in that cricket. So please make a note of such things, and uh, of course, ground dimension. This is this is the traditional center wicket kind of uh, estimates. So during the match, when you get to see the ground, uh, which pitch is being used, then you can decide if you have a shorter boundary or a longer boundary. So which player will be in the game? Usually, pacers will and should dominate this, but good spin bowlers should get something out of it as well. But Yes, absolutely. And uh, before we get to the base team for this game, we hope that all of you are taking active part in the investment leaderboard because it's the most simple thing you can win. All you need to do is join more contests and all your teams are cracking anyway, irrespective of whether you use mine or not, you're making amazing rotations. So just go ahead and join good contests and win lots of prizes. Bilkul, and this is the best time. Uh, as we said, this is uh, Jainata the year. Teams are doing experiments. Living Study is born in the 18th over. It is not somebody any normal human being can uh, comprehend or predict by yoga. And he'll be able to take three wickets and not Adil Rashid, who is the traditional leg spinner in the side. So please make most of your great knowledge, gut feel, and uh, make multiple combinations, but keep the base safe. So that is important. Base is not too much. Form se masti mat karo. But yes, do try your multiple combinations. Yes, absolutely. So now that we have discussed the base quite a bit, let's look at what our base team for this game is. Yep. So here is the base team for India versus Netherlands. 
and like you can see we've gone captaincy and vice captaincy but first up let's look at the picks in keeping and batting scott edwards from netherlands in the keeping section and then four batters max virat kohli lokesh rahul and rohit sharma nikhil bhai any additional picks that you're tempted to make here uh tom cooper if i felt he was batting well and rhythm mm. uh, but unfortunately that has not been the case i personally love the way tom bats he spread a lot mm. of cricket in australia of course uh, plays a lot of he very knows conditions in out but as a quite able to put up he is your differential number 1 but very very risky pick max so down much better rhythm much better form has been scoring runs consistently you will see rohit and kl score runs very soon i i feel uh, i don't know if both of them will score or one of them will score but conditions are important if they are batting first i expect fred class to trouble them a bit but not much so wahan pe un dono mein se kisi ek pe you feel you want to take a risk uh, you can do that i feel both of them are likely to uh, do well so yes that's i think very i think or sky ko bhi you can take if you feel in that batting first chase mein shayad sky ko mein nalu uh, but again if you expect the wickets to fall to be up sky ko bhi le sakte yes very fair call in the all rounders we have gone with hardik and bastelidi captain and vice captain not too much to discuss here both have been in good form and both will bowl important overs and bat so then there's no reason why they won't be captaincy vice captaincy and bowlers we have gone bhuvi shami ashdeep and paul van meekren again all form picks and we expect the indian bowlers to dominate in this game बिल्कुल आई थिंक काफी जैसे आपने कहा चारों ही एकदम ऑब्वियस पिक्स हैं आपके लिए मूवी शमी आई थिंक सभी लेके आएंगे इनको ऑल वेल मिक्रन हैज बीन द बेस्ट बोलर फॉर नेदरलैंड्स फॉर क्वाइट अ व्हाइल नाउ सो नो सरप्राइजेस इन दैट एंगल एज वेल फ्रेंड क्लास में हमने डिस्कस करा फॉर्स बोलिंग में इंपॉर्टेंट हो सकता है लोगन वैन बिग सरप्राइजिंगली हैज बीन बी यूज्ड दैट वेल तो एक कोई गेम उनका आएगा जब वो भाई साहब तीन चार विकेट लेके जाएंगे बट अगेन देयर यूसेज ऑफ बोलर्स has been a bit tricky with netherlands so please be sure of that or or all rounders mein i i don't see hardik not play but if he is not fit kyunki thode fitness mujhe lag rahi thi shayad nikal gaya kuch hai pichle game mein so if he drops out then you'll have to change but otherwise i think sabhi ke captain wo do rehne wale uh, that is hardik uh, pandya and basili basili more so if netherlands are bowling first and uh, if netherlands are batting first maybe you could go with one of the uh, one of the indian pacers Yes, absolutely. Very fair calls, and like you can see, he's concealed all his Grand League picks for the next section. No hints given there. <laughs> so let's look at what the picks are. Sir, you go Tell first. Us, you go first. One no, from sir, India, no. one from the Reds. The honor is all yours. अरे फिर मैं लूँगा तो बोलते हो कि मेरा pick ले लिया. नहीं आप ले लो. ठीक है ठीक. Okay, no problem. so uh, as i said my first pick uh, will be aksar patel uh, i didn't hmm. say but i had it in my mind because uh, if you see the batting order apart from vikram jit uh, not too many left handers if i get hmm. correct so excellent time chance for him to bowl a lot of overs and he bowled only one over last game so he should be in the game far more comparatively hmm. and the other pick as i said uh, slightly uh, bit confused between logan van beek and tom cooper so hmm. it will be one of them depending on the first conditions right very fair call for me from netherlands is going to be fred klassen because we have some history against left arm pace but i feel if role of van der moer plays he might have a handy role to play especially if he is batting first and bowling second he can be someone i'm not saying as captaincy vice captaincy yeah. but as dream team player with 30 40 odd points he can do that job for you and from india dinesh karthik if india bats first not because yeah. i'm expecting india to lose a lot of wickets but because i feel like after the 13th over yeah. he might yeah. see a steep acceleration which would mean that he could have a vital role to play bilkul and also do not forget the role that uh, pringle plays uh, pringle has been batting higher up the order as well so he is also a left arm spinner who could trouble this indian uh, batting and who's had his chance against left arm spinner as well so mm. hopefully ideally no such troubles for india if you see from the indian point of view 
but from fantasy point of view, these are some picks because if you see last few games, Marcus Stone is Glenn Maxwell, uh, today Liam Livingstone. People who are don't you don't expect them to be doing the bulk of or the hmm. impact kind of knocks or spells, they're doing that. So uh, in your multiple combinations, please use all of these suggestions and yes, go big. Yes, absolutely. And before we end this preview, keep in mind that you answer this simple question to be yep. in the run to win the jersey. All you need to do is put in the predicted, predicted highest pointer of the day from your end. So, example, if your predicted player is Ravi Chandran Ashwin, write his name, slash the player points. And please ensure the spellings are correct because we calibrate the right winners by search. So, keep in mind that you do that. Fastest and first wins, no multiple and edited comments. Beautiful and uh, yes, please use all your gut feel here. Best chance to win a Yes, absolutely. And on that note, we end this preview. Thank you so much for tuning in and we hope that all of you have a great game. Have a good time, guys. Take care.